I became disabled in 2010. And um, after my insurance ran out and my parents had paid for two years for my care, and including the time, at first I qualified for Medicaid HMO, well, straight Medicaid, even then my parents had to support me. And then finally, they're, you know, they ended up having to take care of house repairs. I remember they needed their house repairs. They're like, all right. <laughs> so it's like I really needed to take, because it was hard taking Medicaid, because it's like supposed to be the lowest thing you can ever have. And, but I had to, I had no choice. So I took, I became a Medicaid recipient and I started using, and my dad is on the older side. So when I use a different, I used um, me, uh, call that, uh, the medical assistance transportation program. And when I was living with my mom and dad, they didn't want me using SNAP because that's even worse. And then, um, so she wouldn't accept it. My mom wouldn't accept it. She'd be like, oh, no, no, you don't have to just give, it, give that back. Give that back. You don't need it. But I qualified for it. And so I, what happened was the first time it happened, six months later, they took the money back because I didn't use it. But then I moved out on my own, and I needed, I needed all the services I could get. <laughs>